The Toland man is 2,400 year old bog body and victim of human sacrifice from the Iron Age found in Bjeldskavdal in Denmark. His body was so well preserved that even after 2,400 years scientists were able to take his fingerprints and determine what he had eaten last. Also the oldest known bog body is the skeleton of Kohlberg man from Denmark, who has been dated to 8000 BCE, during the Mesolithic period. The oldest fleshed bog body is that of Cashel man, who dates to 2000 BCE during the Bronze Age. The overwhelming majority of bog bodies including examples such as Toland Man, Grauball Man and Lindo Man, date to the Iron Age and have been found in Northwest Europe particularly Denmark, Germany, the Netherlands, United Kingdom, Sweden, Poland and Ireland. Such Iron Age bog bodies typically show a number of similarities such as violent deaths and a lack of clothing which has led archaeologists to believe that they were killed and disposed in the bogs as a part of a widespread cultural tradition of human sacrifice or executed as criminals. Bogs could have indeed been seen as liminal places positively connected to another world, which might welcome contaminating items otherwise dangerous to the living. More recent theories postulate that bog people were perceived as social outcasts or witches, as legal hostages killed in anger over broken treaty arrangements, or as victims of an unusual death eventually buried in bogs according to traditional customs. Unlike most ancient human remains bog bodies often retain their skin and internal organs due to the unusual conditions of the surrounding area. Combined highly acidic water low temperature, and a lack of oxygen preserved but severely tan their skin. While the skin is well preserved, the bones are generally not due to the dissolution of the calcium phosphate of bone by the peat's acidity. The acidic conditions of these bogs allow for the preservation of materials such as skin, hair, nails, wool and leather which contain the protein.